Hey guys, welcome to my list of the top 10 best Five Nights at Freddy's figures. Let's get into it. Coming at number 10 is Liberty Chica. I think this figure is really underrated and is one of the best AR figures. Coming at number 9 is Funtime Freddy. I may have some bias because he's my favorite FNAF character. However, this fig is really good and born born. Coming at 8 is Lolbert. This fig art is so cool. I'm very frustrated because I found this figure once at Tesco and never bought it. Coming at 7th is Jacko Chica. This figure is easily the best nightmare animatronic figure. However, the same with Lolbert in a way. When this figure released, I thought the UK wouldn't get it in, however. FBI got it in sometime late 2017 for a few weeks, and I missed out. Coming at 6th is Spring Trap. This is one of the few figures from this list I actually own. This figure is so highly detailed and one of the best BAFs. Coming at 5th is Toxic Spring Trap, similar to the old one but with a brand new sculpting and the detail on the figure with the toxic waste is amazing. Also, glows in the dark. So, added points. Coming at 4th is Freddy Frostbear. This figure is so nice. This was the first figure to have a translucent body that has been on a lot of figures recently. Right, I have very fond memories of getting this guy from America. And this was also the last exclusive. Before the UK started getting all of that exclusives in. Coming at number 3 is Anna. I got this guy for Christmas 2017. However, for some reason, he broke like 5 minutes after I got him. Same with the rest of the wave for some odd reason. However, besides the breakage, he was a really nicely sculpted figure. And the paint job was the second best on any FNAF figure. Second to last best FNAF figure in my opinion is Scrap Baby. I don't have this figure but boy, it looks incredible. I have about half of her and what I've got of her is really nice. I may be getting all of her soon. Her paint job is immaculate, best out of any FNAF figure. And in terms of detail, the best however. However, the best Five Nights at Freddy's figure goes to Glitch Trap. I'm not quite sure what it is about this figure, but I love it so much. It's just so cool the simplicity of it is what makes me love it. It's such an awesome figure. Funny how the Curse of Dread Bearway has some of the highest highs and lowest lows in the entire line. Well, that'll do it for today. If you like this style of content on the channel, hit subscribe so I can know you all enjoy it and I can make more like this. Consider checking out my other video. That should be out when this one's out. Goodbye.